Hey, it's Ken Gaddy with YouTube Channel Game Bits, here to play The Red Lantern from Timberline Studios on the Nintendo Switch. This is a game about a young woman moving to Alaska to race sled dogs. Let's find out how her journey begins. I mean, I love it already. It's got dogs. I love dogs. Oh my gosh. I've always wanted a dog. I've never had a dog. I have fostered dogs, though. That's close. Do you have those moments that just stick out in your mind? Those ones that just stay with you? forever. When I was a kid, I was told, you are what you do. So choose wisely. And I tried to choose doctor. Okay, I can move my viewing radical that around. That didn't take. I can still hear him. You know, this, this just isn't for you. But I knew what they meant. This just isn't you. Maybe that's a good thing. You don't want to be it's probably not a problem not. for you, is it, buddy? Chomper, world's best pup and friend. Eyes on the road. Chaser of squirrels, smeller of city streets, and chewer of literally everything. Everything. <laughs> See, you know exactly who Yay. you are. Oh, I wish I could say the same. I probably should have had a backup plan, huh? Guess I haven't exactly made the best decisions it's lately. It's not easy. <laughs> Except for adopting you, of course. I thought you had be pretty lost. And I sure as hell wouldn't be out on this road in the middle of nowhere, Alaska. That's kind of redundant. But we needed a fresh start, and I've dreamed of dog sledding since I was wow. a kid. Margot made the races sound incredible. Mom, sister, friend, aunt. And from how you've dragged me up and down the streets of San Francisco, I think you have dog racing dreams too. Huh. Well, let's go assemble us a team, huh, Chomper? We need four more pups to start training. Four more. Okay. Five dogs. Oh, hey! We just passed mile marker 32! What? I didn't see a sign. So, the ad said that just after the mile marker, there would be a kennel with a dog sledding veteran we could adopt. Figure we can check out the pup, maybe add some experience to our team. What do you think? You use the word pup a lot. I don't think that means what you think it means. And you can't carry the sledding gear on your own. Even if you think you can. <laughs> Ambitious little pupper. So I'm already getting the sense that this game is a bit like Firewatch. Igloo. Where are Iggy. you, girl? Aw. <gasps> Hi. You know you have a house right there. You don't have to be in the snow. <laughs> so what am I doing here? Right. Home is where you make it, huh, Iggy? Are you gonna fly? Do you want to come? Come with me, if you want to. Oh, are you just a big old snowball? I can't move. Big, fluffy, loud. If I say no, then are there other dogs? I'm gonna say yes. Jeez, I can't say no to a dog. Never could. So your owner said you're ready for an adventure. You love being out in the Where's wild. Where's Chomper? But they've grown too old for the risks of what's out there. And trade them in. Well, I think we can make this happen. They've got a new life to start. Yay. But everything should be, right? You only get nervous when you're doing something new. Let's awaken those nerves. <laughs> Still three more dogs, Just a though. a few more miles to our next stop. We're looking for three more wow. pups to fill out our team and help us get to our new so home. So this is a slow start. Lots of exposition. Probably just gonna say yes to every dog. Stilton? Dear God, your eyes are blue. Wow. They're brighter than the sky, Stilton. And you don't seem to miss a thing. You're keeping a constant watch. That's a good quality. I bet you know everything that goes on, huh, old boy? You're supposed to be retired, but it sounds like you've been keeping tabs on the pups and leading their training runs. I'm gonna say yes. I know some pups that would love to have you around. Uh, I, I'm not seeing dogs I can't love. I don't know what other so qualities meet I should the team. be for. I think we're a pretty great bunch. Ah, uh -huh, look at that like face. got like a cold fire in those eyes. People shouldn't give up on you so quickly. <sighs> but I guess some people get obsessed with crushing the competition <laughs> and they don't see the value of a well-rounded team. We can't all be speedsters or beasts. Sometimes you need a pup who can let you know when you're steering the team into yeah. trouble. Or a moose. A dog you can listen to. I hear moose are more threatening than bears. Is that true? I'm gonna take that growl as a yes. We're out here to become a real dog musher and, you know, 
hopefully one day win a race or two. How's that sound? Let's see. We've got to prove we can hack it out here. We need to find out what we're made of. Or sometimes you just need a new challenge. We've got to prove it. I don't know to whom, but... Nothing's going to stop us. It's just us and the world. We own our fate here. We're glad to have you, Stilton. I don't know what the ride is going to be like, but we're definitely going to have an adventure. So the voice... I'm not sure oh. if I'm picking you based on your skills or just because I can't pass <laughs> up. But I am very excited about this team we Definitely put together. The we have six stops to go, and we only need to adopt two more oh. dogs. Oh, okay. So the voice you're hearing is Ashley Birch, who also played Chloe Price from Life is Strange, and also Aloy from Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh, you're not a small fella, are you? They said you were big, but you're going to make Chomper look like he was mixed with a corgi. You're actually kind of intimidating. Okay, it sounds like you've gotten into a few fights out there in the wilderness, and that you always stuck by your musher's side, but they were afraid you would jump into a fight you couldn't That's not win. good. But now you've become restless, being stuck back in the kennel, howling at night for the wild you can't get to. Well, we're hopefully going to have a nice training run out to a new home. We'll see plenty of wild things, I'm sure. And I'd like to avoid the fights I can't win, too. I think this could be good. I don't know. Us. He sounds like a handful. All right. Maybe more than I need. What do you think? I'm going to say no to this dog. Besides that name, it's too cliche. It looks like you've got a pretty good life here. It's great meeting you, Barkley. Hi, Barkley. Isn't Barkley the dog from Sesame Street? I want that dog on my team. Okay, so far so good. Two pups out of the three stops is a great start. Indeed. We only need to adopt two more dogs, and we have five more stops. I think we'll be okay. So speaking of a slow start, when I first launched this game, it took 90 seconds from the Switch main menu. Noodle, huh? <laughs> I can see that. I said running alone wasn't enough for you. You were looking for some kind of challenge and a musher who would listen to you too. Well, I don't really know what I'm doing, so uh, having some help out there might be nice. I, I don't know anything about this dog, though. They, uh, you need more, more details. You still like to run, right? I promise we'll still get plenty of rest. <laughs> you look ready for snugs. Just know that I still have to make the calls and try to do what's best for us. Will that work for you? Okay, all right. Ready to go meet the rest of the new team? I'm not, I'm not entirely confident about that choice, but he's a cutie. Well, welcome to the van. This is Chomper. He's a city pup, but he's ready to get out there and learn how to become a sled dog. You ready to help us train? It sounds like you weren't too big a fan of indecision last time you raced. So you decided which way to go if your driver didn't? Oh. And that I should trust you when I'm not sure what's that best. That like a feature. How about I take the lead on most decisions, but if I'm unsure, you can help me out. But you can't just lay down in the middle of the trail, no. okay? We've got a new life to start. And once we're home, I'll build you a nice little den with a perfect nap Aww. zone. Nap zone. How's that sound? I want a nap zone. <laughs> All right, you're right. Rest up. We've got plenty of running ahead of us. So we got Chomper, Stilton, and Noodle. Adopting dogs is so easy. I basically just love all <laughs> Our team is almost complete, and I've only met a few dogs. We've got four more stops to find our last team. Wow. Ahead. That means I can reject three more dogs. Maybe I shouldn't have been so quick. Finn. Let's get a little harness on. Hey, girl. Are you Finn? Quite the uh, collection you've gathered what here. What you got? Are these all things you found? They said you're pretty good with your nose. You tend to follow that more than anything else. Sometimes that led you to good things. Sometimes it led you to skunks. <laughs> Your owners got tired of skunks, huh? Well... Uh, yeah, let's let's take it. I don't really know my way out there. We might need some help to find more than just the trail. And while you might not be the best at running, it'd be great to have some help to know what to do. There's a lot I don't know about the Alaskan bush. And it's probably important that I try to recognize that I don't know what I don't know. <laughs> okay, then. Uh, let's do it. Seems like we could use a smart dog with a nose for the trail on our team. We'd love to have you, Finn. She does seem to be leaning on her dogs a lot, though. Looking to them to decide what to do. Hey, team. I'd like to introduce you all to Finn. Finn comes to us, well, from the Alaskan bush. Just like many of you do. Except for you, Chomper. Finn is joining us from a family from way out here. That's everybody, right? So, Finn, you like collecting things, huh? Chomper's the same. Every morning I wake up and he's piled all my shoes <laughs> on my bed and is using them as a pillow. That's amazing. It's probably not quite the same. That's similar. Your family said you'd never come back in from walks. 
You're always yearning to discover more out there, but you had a tendency to not know when you should stop and take a break. You just push and find yourself too tired to get back no. easily. That sounds like we'll have the right kind of adventures then. We're gonna keep going and rest along the way to, well, Why wherever. didn't you tell me these things before I adopted you? We'll probably have to make some decisions we don't want to, but that's how we find out what we truly are. Are you a pup that can smell porcupines and keep your nose out of trouble? I hope so. Don't just sit there. Because I'd be happy to avoid whatever trouble I can. Well, you ready? Jumper, you approve? That's everybody. We're happy to have you, Finn. Right? Oh, you're right. <laughs> We're nearly at the next stop. Or do I need one more? Thanks. I've lost track. Y you mind if I give you a <gasps> pet? Yes, all the pets. Aw. Okay, well, that's pretty good. good. Maybe we'll get to a pet eventually. But I will accept a cautious... <laughs> now there's a pickup line. Hey, Chomper, you have to take it slow too, okay? She's not ready for you, your lack of personal Consent. boundaries. I can't believe it. We're really about to do this. We've got an incredible team here, and all that's left for us is to head out to our new oh, home. That's all. So this is kind of like the opening of Firewatch, where it was text-based decisions that determine the rest of the story, and then you get into the game. Wow, well you look at that. What a landscape. Oh, and there's a trail running through the title. That's clever. I can't believe we made it to Alaska, Chomper. Me neither. Margo said to travel to the end of the road, and then hop on the sled, and travel a few days Days more. on the sled, we wow. We know her cabin by the red lantern hanging by Oh, we have a title. And she gave us this map. Where's the map? Oh. It's uh, not as helpful as I'd like. There's a maze in the lower left, and but there's macaroni get us and there. cheese. We just have to pick our path. Huh. Oh, wait, I didn't memorize that. So, you're going to have to take the lead. It's a lot of responsibility looking out for a team, but I think you're ready you're for it. You're taking a San Francisco pet and putting it at the ready head to find of our a new sled. home. <laughs> yeah, me too. Has this dog trained for this? All right, let's make sure we have what Look we need. Look at that need. dog rolling around his back. We've got our team. Finn, Stilton, Iggy, Noodle. And Chomper. And the sled is all ready to go. We've packed the bare essentials to get us started, but we're going to have to live off the land once we get to our cabin, so we might as well start training for that now too, right? Oh, what's happening? Two pieces of raw meat. Okay. You pups can handle the uncooked, raw, and cold Ew. food. The kind we'll also find on the trail. But I'm gonna have to cook that up if I don't want to freeze my insides. Seriously. Hypothermia is not something I'm really looking to try. Could we also be vegetarian, please? We'll be able to set up camp once we get properly out on the trail. I scrounged up this old gun and a couple of bullets. Three bullets. Just in case. So we'll make do with what we have. We can use them to hunt or keep them around in case we need to protect ourselves. I would with more than three bullets. It is the wilderness, after all. You know, bears, moose, wolves, skunks. Oh, and most importantly, we've got one med Yay. pack. I should be able to bandage us up if something happens. So unlike Oregon Trail, I don't get to choose okay. my quantities. Well, I guess we should start. What do they say Mush. Again? Mush, let's go on way. Mush on. Uh, mush on. They, oh, they're just magically moving. They were sliding on their butts for a moment there. That was weird. Okay, so I can look around, but I'm not steering the sled. The dogs are doing that. Or the game is, however you want to put it. Uh, yep, so there's everything. Now out here, we oh. don't say left and right. That's the y button. We use ha for left. And G for right. Why? So, let's go. Yes, yeah, I just figured that out. So, that's me on the left side. Why can't I go straight? Why do I have to go left or right? Oh, well, let's try going right. G! Oh, okay. Along the trail, you will run into encounters. Encounters have risks, but also bring rewards. You won't survive without exploring, but going into encounters costs hunger. Or makes me hungry, if you want to put it that way. Oh, uh, oh! In the upper left, the one surrounding what looks like a, my stomach. If your hunger meter is empty, you need to eat soon. Shouldn't it be if your hunger meter is full? That's weird. 
You need to eat soon or risk losing your current run. Okay, so here's where I go right, because I just said G instead of Ha. And I don't really know how that... Rabbit's supposed to be a delicacy. Oh. What do you think, pups? Can we check it out? I don't want to use a bullet on something so small. Hey, little bunny. You mind being bait for what? What does that mean? I'm sure something big is tracking you. You are not very good bait. Oh. You didn't even move. What are you even eating? It's just snow. <laughs> Wait, am I the bait? Oh no. Go ahead, Chomper. All right, Chomper. On my call, you get to... Oh, you missed. All right, leave it, Chomper. All right, let's go. Well, B for effort, Chomper. Oh, I worked up an appetite. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on my hunger when I venture off. What a weird way to put things. Keep I an eye on here. my hunger. Let's go. Oh, okay. What do my other buttons do? Oh, left. These are the trigger buttons. You can lean left and right. Crossing a trail marker costs one energy. Oh, your run will end if you cross a trail marker when either your hunger meter or your dog's energy meter is empty. So how will I know when those are coming up? Because I want to be prepared. I don't see them on the map. Mm, lean to the right. And what does leaning do for me? Just does change my perspective? Finn, what do you smell, girl? Is there something worth checking out up there? Oh, I'm going to let Finn tell us where to go. Although I do realize if I make all girl? of these stops, I am going to get well, very Finn, hungry. get out of there! No! <sighs> Finn... Previous owners warned us. But hey, you followed your nose, and it could have been something amazing. We'll try again sometime. I'm not gonna be mean to a dog I just adopted just because he made I'm a back. bad call. Let's get back out there. I don't have to, like, desync my dog. There are no ramifications for this. This decision will have I know consequences. It didn't work out this time, Finn, but I trust what you can find. Okay. You've got a nose that shows you far more than I can see. And you're probably used to smelling like skunk Oh, I would have gone left there, but I didn't have that choice. Ooh, I can see my shadow. Not like Shadow Chance and Sassy. There is a marker. I see a trail marker. Oh, I can choose to camp? Oh, it didn't stop to let me decide. It just kept going. It's not really that dark, though. I don't want to camp yet. I can make it a little bit farther. Oh. It's far away, but it's here. What should we do? Oh, that's a big old moose or caribou or something. Let's try to hunt it. Just have to, you know, adjust for wind, distance, that uh, physics parking thing. What was that? A parabola? parabola? Is that right? Come on, back to present. Okay, it's just a little further away. Time to take our chance. All right. Oh, how do I? Oh, did I miss my shot? Is it going to come back? Here we go. Was it ZR to shoot? Great. Just yeah. great. I guess I have to wait for those things yeah, to line yeah, up. Yeah, you're right. I can't dwell. Which they did on I the first try. For and I, I did this. Missed and it on just the third. Have to keep going. Oh well. That's only 33% of my bullets. Who okay, needs bullets, I'm back. right? Okay. That's on how you At spell least we've okay. got two bullets. All right. Let's mush on. All right, do your little butt sliding thing. There you go, just magic skis. So one of the things I like about this game is in the options before the game starts. Oh, there's another trail marker. Hmm. Let's go. Oh. Let's uh, stick to the right again. G. One of the options is to ensure that the dogs never die. So I guess there are bears out there and they can kill the dogs if they get into a fight that they shouldn't or can't win. And Wait, is that a caribou? Let's hunt it again. Because I'm getting hungry. <coughs> so not everybody is going to want a virtual dog to die if they can avoid breathe. it. So that can actually be an option. Trigger. Okay, so I don't think I can actually control the aiming. So I just have to wait for those things to line up. Oh, that was it. Oh, oh, catch up to it. Yeah, yeah. I hit it. I hit it. And it's still fine. Great. 
Oh, last bullet. You hit this caribou. You will kill this caribou. Ugh, I'm vegetarian. I would not kill that caribou. Yes! Yes! We did it! Boat is ours! <laughs> Woo! We're pretty good at this. Okay, that's not anything I would ever do in real life, but... Uh, howl along with the dogs? Why not? No, that's weird. So how much food is that? That was a good diversion. Some more food. Just one? One piece of meat? That's I'm it? I'm starving. Yeah, I am starving. So, what do I need to do about that? We don't need bullets to survive. We need to camp, right? Is that when I can eat? All right, let's mush on. So I, oh, I have six meat now. I had only three. Okay, so that's good. I doubled my meat. Yes. Let's take a break. Let's take a break. I'm not sure I saw a trail marker, but oh, now it asks yes or no. We uh, set up a pretty good camp. Uh -huh. We've got our meat all strung up to be out of reach of bears. Good. And we can make a fire. It'll be nice to cook up some food or warm my bones. And the meat. And of course, I can check on all of Little you. Little tent for the dogs. Dog tent. That's amazing. Okay. Aw, dog bowl. How tired am I, though? How can I tell if I'm tired? I don't think I'm tired. Wow. Pet chomper, yes, you can pet the dog. That's amazing. I take this mitten off, but I fear frostbite. <laughs> That's great. I, I think it's just going to keep petting Chomper until I push a button. So here I'm going to push A. Yep. Can I pet all the dogs? I am, because I, if I can, I will. You keeping a lookout for all of us? He, I can almost feel how soft he is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to distract you too much, but I think it's time for some good old pets. Good ole pets. Maybe some of these. Aww. And a bit of a scratch here. <laughs> this is great. All the dogs. Pet noodle. <laughs> Hi, noodle. He is my pet noodle. Oh, he curls up in a little ball. This is feeling more exciting to you. Getting the hang of this noodle? Yeah, okay. Let's just get some scratches in. Right. I'm just here to pet you. Understand? How can I scratch you with my mitten on? Two more dogs. Gotta pet them all. Iggy. Scratches, scratches, scratches. <laughs> I want to like copy this script and paste it into Ashley Birch's other games. I want to hear Aloy saying, scratches, scratches, scratches. You did good out there. I don't mind you found a skunk. I trust you, Finn. You can trust me. Aw. But you still smell a little. Yay, Finn trusts you too. I earned his trust by not being a jerk. All right, let's check out this fire. Fire would bit. be nice. Yes. Start fire with Birch. Okay. Just huh. a little Birch Because her name is Ashley Birch. Well, Get it? Spark and behold. Fire. She's probably heard that before, though. Okay. I'm ready to cook some food. Yes. Now, I don't have to cook it for the dogs, but can I? Oh, how much food do I want to eat? Well, as much as I can, I guess. Wow, she's going to eat all that? It's a lot of food. I should give the dogs some food, too. Food time! Chow down, pups! Oh, look at that face. Oh, gosh. Food does not go as far for these dogs. Probably because there are so many of them. And now I'm out of food and bullets. So how does this game continue? I don't need to use the med kit. I don't think I need to... S oh, can I sleep? No. Let's get back on the trail. Back on the trail? We still have a few Ready hours of sunlight left, so let's make the most of them. Get farther along the trail, and we can rest when the sun sets. All right. Come on, doggos. Look at those little tails. Oh. Oh, that was a saving your game icon. Oh, what? <sighs> I wish I had known we were so close to sunset. Oh, uh, what's going on up there, Stilton? What is that? I don't see anything. Stilton? Let's, uh, run away. Leave it. 
Mush on. I want to get to the next camp, camp as soon as possible. Yes, we should camp and we should sleep. Okay, so I made it a little we bit We should farther. be able to take care of ourselves here. Should we camp? Yes. I Didn't I just say that? We should be able to take care of ourselves here. What? That was, that was weird. Okay, go to sleep. Might be time to get some should rest. Should I start a fire? Sure my stomach will be grumbling by morning. But the dogs will be energized. Well, should we go to sleep? I, my stomach is full. What are you talking about? Six hours. All right. Everyone feeling better? Oh. Wait, what? Finn? What's up, Finn? Did you take my beanie? Ha! Ah. It kind of looks like you did. Are you comforted by my scent? He collects things. That's what he does. Because I think you're thinking about being my friend. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, I'll need that hat back before we go running, but you can keep it for now. Aw. Okay. Look at that sky. And what is that big... Oh, it's a cloud. It must be a cloud, right? That is the Milky Way, the galactic core. I can't make out any constellations from here. Maybe if I turn my flashlight off. But... Uh, so, should I go... I, mean, I slept for six hours, and now it's dark out. Should I... get back on the trail? Back on the trail? Finn? I'm gonna need my beanie back now. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Ready to go? Mushing in the middle of the night does not seem wise, but... Isn't that what... Oh! Jeez! What is happening? Hmm... Let's go. That was weird. Uh, let's mix things up and go left for once. Ha! Ran on a frozen lake. Uh, is that a achievement? Like I've always wanted to do this. Oh, wow. You're a big fella, aren't you? Who? It's okay, pups. I got this. Oh, look at that. Why would I check it out if I can't hunt it? But I am out of food, so maybe there's something I can do. Maybe I can sick chomper on him. Wow! Oh, you're really close. You see those eyes? Look at those horns. Uh, antlers. Antlers. Antlers fall off. Horns do not. That is a terrible idea. Okay, stay calm. Isn't this what I wanted? This is not a, this is not a domestic animal. Why am I trying to pet it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. Should have expected that. There has never been a sign I that says please I knew that was a bad idea, but I wanted to see how it would Come play out. You were right. I might need to patch myself up soon. Well, this game is realistic in that sense. Now you know. Don't pet the elk. I think I just have to risk the bad luck. I think we're done here. I mean, is there a Let's version go. of this game where that would have ended well? Should you ever make that decision? Jeez. Is that a trail marker? I didn't give me the option to camp. Why the random left and right veering? I can still I can't believe tilt. the ice can just control a river of this size. How much food is just traveling beneath us? Fish. It looks like there's an opening up ahead. <gasps> oh, I, I, it won't let me go fishing? What do I need to do to be able to fish? There's nothing for us here except for the chance of an icy end. Let's go. I guess there are different choices I could have made that maybe would have introduced me to... A fishing rod? Now what? Oh, now what? Uh... Ha! Ha! Saw the plains. The rain in Spain stays mainly there. Alright. I'm... Oh! Bird. I'm certain I read that owls are good omens. Or wait. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. Sounds pretty good to me. What do you pups think? That didn't seem like a very con- Oh! No, don't- Uh, yeah, noodle. Yeah, follow it is. Let's go, Really? Noodle. We're gonna follow an owl? Why? Ah, oh, good omen! That's what we needed, team! What do we think it'll lead us to? So we've some birch. It's a good start. 
Why would I? Okay. Maybe it wants us to eat it? Ha! <laughs> Why is bark so hard to rip off? Oh, well, at least I didn't hurt Thank myself you. doing it. So, what does that do for me? Pups do okay. This birch will really help. Why? How? Ready to go? It says I have an extra. What is that again? <laughs> Somewhere to sleep. My dogs are gonna be hungry soon, and I have no food. And that looked like yeah, a trail we're... marker actually doing pretty well. No, we're not. I mean, we're still alive. Barely. And we're getting closer to our new home. Slowly. You know, just have to make it past some more trees, and snow, probably some more snow, and then we'll be there. Oh, you no. pups look like an incredible team. You even move as one. I am very impressed with your sled dog instincts. We might already be out of food, but I I'm sure we'll be fine. And we probably don't need any more bullets. I mean, somebody hid bullets out here, right? What? And it's been really nice not seeing any other people. It's just us in the world. And the, world the stars went away. Us. I didn't expect to talk out loud this much, but we're really doing this. We're, I, I mean, I, I'm becoming a musher. Oh, is that sunrise? Like a real That's one. That's cool. I think Margo would be proud. I still can't believe she gave us her old cabin and, and gear. We still have to make we're it making there. Making progress. We should be there soon enough. Wow. I, I would not attempt this in real life. Like, if it was like some sort of a tourist expedition where you pay to mush for a day, sure. But this actual living off the land, I don't have that skill. And I'm not particularly interested in acquiring it. So when the zombie apocalypse happens... Look out! <gasps> oh, Stay man. back! Is that it? What is that? Get out of here! Looks like a boar with horns. Oh, it's a Iggy! Some sort of sheep. Leave them! Get the heck out of here. <laughs> we outnumber you by a lot. Maybe not in pounds though. Come on, there's six of us. That worked? <gasps> no! Oh. oh! And I didn't already use my med kit. It said if I got injured again. Iggy! Okay. You're all okay. You're all in here. Oh man. I don't know how we do this without you, Iglo. You put the team before yourself every time. I'm gonna try to be as good as you. Okay. Wait, did I just Iggy have die? To be prepared. And hope the world is on my side. What happened here? Okay. So that was the end of that run. Oh, I start future runs with more resources. Oh, that's how you don't suck. So it's almost like a roguelike. Like Dead Cells. The more runs you do, the easier future runs get. Without smell out there on the plains, there's just so much ice. Are we? There are really a million lakes here. Oh. So this is a journal that you can see at the beginning of the game. I didn't show you because there was something there at the time. Because I hadn't made any runs. Wow. So... This is what the journal looks like. There you go. Fed the pups a feast for dog kings. Hanging with my fluffy friends. Oh, it has a little star next to caribou. Because I saw a caribou. And the ptarmigan? Was that? No, that's not an owl. I saw a skunk. That's filled in. And the caribou and the bunny. Huh. So what do you say? Wow, so that's the first run on the Red Lantern. It seems a little rough around the edges. I saw some visual clipping and the like. And sometimes the dialogue, when it goes from line to line, there's no natural pause. It's like it's, it's rushing through the script. But I love the dogs. I love that you have choices of dogs. It's kind of like a choose your own adventure game. Uh, there was Alchemy Labs did a computer game called Discourse, I believe it was called. That was a little bit like this a few years ago. And Firewatch did it, but with more freedom to explore. So this is an interesting game. I definitely want to try it again. But I think for today, for this video, that's good for my first run. And I'm hoping that it'll 
Nope, my progress. So the next time I boot the game up, I do have more resources. Because I want to pet all the dogs. Alright, that's it for this video from YouTube Channel Gamers. I've been Ken Gagney. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Wow, that was unceremonious. I thought she might go back to being a doctor.